Is it on? Yeah, but you don't have to worry about when it's on. It's Just, on now? Yeah. Alright, you guys want to see some really cool tortoises? Check these out. The snow, half snow, half regular leopard tortoises. Uh, is it going to be able to see real good? Oh, yeah. Look at this guy. He's like pure, almost pure white. Wow. I don't know if I can sell these or not. I might have to keep these. Look at that. Crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is the most beautiful tortoise. Uh, it's insane. This one. Oh my gosh. Look at this one. They all got their own special stuff. Look at that. These were born in Florida? Oh yeah, right here in Houston, Florida. And then you got the new guys. Hunter? Can you say hi, Hunter? Can you say hi, Hunter? Say hi to everybody in TV land. Say hi everybody in TV land. Say hello. Hello TV land. And that's not going to be a while before we do that, huh? Yeah. Hunter's nice. Hunter's a good boy. Oh, Hunter. So, one new family member. The next new family member is not as nice. We're just gonna show you later how you make it nice. Mitch Rambo. Rambo, say hello. See how he's mean now? Oh yeah, now I'm liking everybody. We're saying that in a little while. Stay tuned. Not mean, it's just uh, attitude. And then we got the ponds redone. There's no turtle, turtle. Guppy pond, guppy topia. People would say that green stuff and think that's a disgusting pond. Guppy topia, look at all the babies. Thanks to Dexter's world. Shout out to Dexter. And then we got our little girl turtle ponds back. Quarantine ponds. Matt Turtle's fixing to go out there to the ponds. And yeah, so um, Freddie has moved on to the quarantine porch so that way she can get closer to the sun. We're just going to find her and then we'll show you how we clean their, their pond out. Ready? So similar. Oh. And this one's ready, you could tell because her shell is almost healed but not quite healed. There's Molly. There's the painted turtle with no name. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and give a treatment here to Freddy. And we have her. And her friend. Shell's looking really good. A little bit of fungus there. There and there. Looks good though. Go ahead and spray her.
Pretty soon we're not going to be able to tell Freddy from the turtle that was brought here with hypovitaminitosis, vitaminasis, hypovitamin something. She needed surgery. Uh, Florida Wild did the surgery and she's doing great. She's grown a lot. And pretty soon we're not going to be able to tell Freddy from her. But that's okay. Still treating her with just blue Dawn dish soap. Let her dry. like Freddy. Let's see. And so to change this pond easily, all we do is take the like And then I'll be able to look to see if I missed Freddy in here. And I pulled out the wrong one. I'm gonna go ahead and treat the painted turtle shell. It's got a little bit of fungus still too. Give him a little treatment. Not as friendly. Not that he's mean, he just wants to be left alone. Alright, but it's beautiful turtles. Really, really good. Okay, Freddy, holy moly. It's a beautiful turtle. It's a beautiful turtle. turtle shells today. Everybody in this one pond gets nice and clean.
wellness check. bulkhead. That's where the pipe goes. Turtle's easy. Mississippi map turtles right here. And uh, you guys, the reason that we're so proud to have found the leopard tortoises that our friend has for sale is because it's important to purchase leopard tortoises that were born in the state that you live in, especially if you're from Florida. So those guys were born right here and uh, they're just going to make somebody really healthy pets versus people who are shipping them in from out of state. So um, we're just so proud to have found them. And I think that what we'll do is we'll go down and check out the nursery, the greenhouse, what's in stock for the week. And then we'll come back here in about an hour and a half to come and get the birds in for the night. Ken, did you find some nice plants for sale this week? Commercial style video what? making. I said, did you find some nice plants this week? We got sugar cane. Nectarines. Nectarines. Figs. Is this Barbados cherry? Um... Oh, it's not. It's one of those blue bushes. I'm stupid. Sarah? Surinam cherry. Sugar apple. Peach. Peach. Java chicago. Mango. Yucca. Alberta cherry. Two different kinds of plums. Lemongrass. Lemongrass. Herbs. Herbs? <laughs> These are legal First herbs. Lane. Got really nice rosemary and thyme. Lemongrass. Lemongrass. 
I got a new um, donkey tail, string of hearts, bat tail, string of dolphins, or beta uh, donkey tail. You can do with these guys. Do some of them. New four inch selection. Some of them are really, really, really pretty. Are all these 352 or are these 450? All 350. Miracle fruit has buds on it or whatever. Like massive, but this is a hundred dollar plant, right? But look, it's got buds. This one? Yeah. But you can get this one for fifty dollars and pretty soon it will bud. Oh, that's a beautiful job at a cava. And somebody came in this week when I was down here. And they said it was trimmed so nicely. <laughs> yeah. String of pearls. The string of hearts are really nice. It's really dark for some reason, but yeah, doing the best we can. Oh, we got some new air plants. This one is neat. Oh, that one's supposed to be I don't supposed to be a medium. She's been showing me medium. So she threw it in there. And that's what a medium usually is. Gorgeous. Right here. These are cool. Um, that one is cool. Big ones. Big ones. All 350? Yeah. And then the deal, the two for 10 is no longer um, happening, but we do got $8, $8. Dollar string of pearls. And we got the four Hoya, but that's all the Hoya we have for the weekend, mm -hmm. huh? That's unusual. If you ask me, the deal in here is the uh, variegated hibiscus that's just really root bound. And you only have $12 put on there. And you have three of them, so somebody could come buy three matching hibiscus that don't look good now, but they're root bound, and then they put them in the ground, and boom, beautiful. Boom. Boom. Got the dollar succulents. Oh, these are really nice, Ken. $3.50 for all these? That's crazy. that we don't want to sell tomatoes because they're not going to really be good for people to grow right now. And we could just make the money, but it's just too hot. Unless you have the perfect environment, like shade cloth structure. Guys, look at the sedum um, burrow tails. I mean, they're really, really nice. They're large. 
nice and cool and only $18.